Right, so day two, let's go. Last night I did go to a Halloween party. <laughs> but I didn't have too much to drink, thankfully. I only had like four beers and then left probably about two or something like that. I think it's like, I got an hour in bed because the clocks went back, so it's about a bit late because VIPs got let in five minutes ago. So I'm gonna have to set off now and uh, yeah, roll on a day of filming. Here we are, day two at the London Card Show. Very, very excited to get in there. Well, I say that, I have actually already been in there. We're filming the intro a little bit late. I've met Tosin already, signed a couple of my cards, so thank you very much to him. And uh, yeah, let's do it. Day two, baby. I would like to thank the sponsors of today's video, which is, of course, Vot. Vot is an app in which you can buy and sell in live video wherever you are. Join hundreds of lives where sellers showcase their items for you to bid on and buy. Whether you collect trading cards, sneakers, sports memorabilia, toys or vintage apparel, Vot is the destination for every collector who wants to share his or her passion. Follow your favorite categories and sellers to get notified for upcoming shows. Chat with them and complete your collection with the app Vot. Once again, Thank you for Vot for sponsoring this video. I don't know, I was a bit far off 50, so I was just wondering to see what his best price would be. Do you need it? I don't know, I might do. Yeah, I see it in a box. I'll give you two pound for it. If you want the same price I paid for it, you can have it. Yes. Yeah? Uh, I know he does it for the prison base, and I see it in a bargain box, so I was waiting to try and find him to see if he needed it or not. I love that, they like, sourced the card for me, that's brilliant. <laughs> Yeah, channel. exactly, yeah. Mate, I'm going. I'm done, I'm tired. Were you here yesterday? Yeah, yeah. trade night as well, I'm shattered. You had a good day? Yeah, I'm tired. Uh, Full you bought anything over a quid yet? Yeah, loads, mate. Yeah, yeah loads. Hold on, mate. Too much. I don't know if I've got any, enough change for you, mate. Have you got change by any chance? No, I need to spend it. What have you got? A quid? Yeah, quid 50. You're a legend. Helps, helps you out, mate. Yeah, no I appreciate worries. that. Thank you very much for that. Nice. Got a nice little Josh on for the PC. Two pounds, super deal. Two pounds. I only had 150, so I had to give him 150. I feel a bit bad, but I'll find him at the next show. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I've got loads of toasting, to be fair. Yeah, Phil and Fern, yeah. You were at Liverpool? No, 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 no. Sorry, Liverpool. You tell you like in America, I'm not sorry. Yeah, yeah. My bad, my bad. Graver Cottage. Yeah. No, Phil and I'll have a walk around. I'll, I'll pro I might be back for that, that messy if, I, if Ben's around. Oh, OK. I'll wait till he's back. I'm not in a rush, so. Are you, you're not going anywhere, are you? This is one of the best cases of, you'll see, I think, at a sports card show. Look at this, look. Maradona's, Messi, Pele, De Stefano. Cruyff. And this is a Ronaldinho section here. So I do like these ones here. 
2010 Premium South Africa. But you can, the comps, the raw comps of those are a bit difficult because you never know what you're buying raw because I suppose they're 2010, people collect them. So I don't know if I want to buy one graded. I think I'd rather buy one raw and then try and grade it myself. But they don't, they don't always come up on eBay. I've got it as a safe search, so I tend to like, it's a little tip, I tend to try and find safe searches. Um, and then I get a notification on my phone when it comes up. So I do want to own one of those one day, maybe a PSA 10. The messy PSA 10s go for about 2K and then the eights go for like 100, 150. So yeah, the difference is insane. So there's a table over here I might take you towards. So it has some nice, uh, nice Ronaldo, messy stuff. Uh, optic De Bruyne number two. 149. 149, okay. And the Messi 250. 250, okay. Did you try have you tried to grade this one or? Uh Lewis so it's Lewis's card. I think he said it has a it's mostly clean as a soft corner. Right. Yeah. I think the, the back one of the back corner, top corners is a little soft. Oh okay. The surface is an eight, you reckon? He's like, I think if it was me, I would try with SGC. Right. But even I don't know, like, if it's worth it because, like, this set's it's like second year Chrome, it's like not as desirable. No, yeah, I see so what you mean. So it's almost like gem or bust, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, thank you. I think I might come back. But... Okay, Should we, let's go. Uh, Wanda. I just want to check the. Uh... The price is on a historic ticket. I'll go over here. Uh, so that's that's a shame. I was looking at the historic tickets, but they're selling for about one, roughly 120. An SGC 10 did 55 quid there. That's awful. Roughly about 120. He had 150, and I, I wouldn't want to bring it down to 85. They're quite common cards, so I feel like I could pick one up at like a fairly decent price. There's plenty on, uh, that are listed on eBay are around 150. So, I mean, it's not, as pricing goes in terms of putting it in a showcase, it's not an unfair price. Um, but I might pass on that one. The other thing that I did like actually was the um, Kevin De Bruyne. It was an Optic Aqua. It's not a it's not a low number, but it's a nice colour match. So raw one did 25 quid. But I don't know about there's there's no comps for graded. So I don't feel too confident paying 150. Difficult. The only other thing that I was maybe looking at was the Pedri Atomic. One sold for 120. I think Ben wants 150 for it. I'd probably be okay paying 120 for it because I feel like it has a lot of upside. It's number to 250, it's a rookie. But what I've been doing recently is not focusing too much on how low numbered it is, more in the, the fact that eye appeal is there. It's not a PSA 10, but I imagine it's quite hard to gem. There probably will be PSA 10s, a few of them out there. But if I'm gonna buy a card, it might be that one. So I'm gonna go and see if, see if he can maybe bring the price down a little bit. Might have left it too late, I can't see it here. Oh no. This could be a disaster. Oh, I see it, I do see it. So, I was looking at the, the Pedri. Yes. I've seen a comp that's about 122. Did you say you wanted 150 on it? Right, okay. 
How firm are you on that? I'm quite firm because I've got a guy who's lifting at both of those and paying uh, 420 for the pair. Right. But I mean, I'll drop to 140 on that if you want to do it now. I think that's fair. There's still room for him to grow as well. Just obviously yeah. High appeal, like you said. It's the eye appeal, I think, that is like, although it's high numbered, it's the eye appeal that's interests me. Yeah, for sure. Hard grade as well, we've heard in that game. Sorry? Hard grade. Atomics are, yeah. yeah. And they're always off centre as well. That's yeah. I've got a couple that I've sent to PSA and they don't look great. I've sent them anyway. Yeah, yeah. They'll give that's nines. Amazing. If it's an eight, it's getting cracked. <laughs> I've um, got back today and uh, surprisingly good. Yeah? Somewhere. I thought we'd get eight or nine, just get ten. Nice. Something. What did you get back today? Is it in the case? Uh, or? No, it's the results got today. Oh, I see. I've got a left one, it's in the sack of rookies. Right. Back in 97. Nice. Would you meet in the middle at 1.30? Because it's you. My man. I appreciate that, thank you. Yeah. PayPal good? Fine. Lovely. Thank you very much, mate. Lovely. There we are. Happy with that. That's probably today and only today's purchase. Don't imagine I'll pick up anything else, but... Is the camera struggling to focus or you got it there? There we are. It's the eye appeal that is the winner for me. So that will, the plan with that is it's gonna stay in the, in my case for a while. I think Pe Pedri is a fairly decent hold. I think he's pretty, pretty liquid, but also pretty stable. Playing for Spain national team, there's a lot of upside with him. He's already won the Copper Trophy. I do favour Pedri a little bit over Gavi, personally. I don't know if that's a controversial statement or not, probably not, but... I'm glad we... I uh, was able to get a deal on camera, at least. Thank you very much. I apologise to the guy that was brokering a deal for the other Pedri as well. I might have messed up that deal, but... It was worth it. There we are, really happy with that. So anyway, you do, could you do 50 on it? I'm not, <laughs> I, I'm not even bothering negotiating anymore. I'm just Not like, at all. Well, okay, we, I'll start at 90 and then I'll come down. I'll just, but you I'll just find said, it a lot easier You to, just said 75. Oh, I'll, I'll do it for 75, yeah. So you start at 75 and come well, down? Well, I, I can go 90 and come down. Right. Or I can do 75 and just give you the price. Okay. So we can start at 90 and we can go past down, down 75. past 75. To 70, I'll do 70. I'm gonna be the worst in the world. Did, how much did you say? How much did you say this one was? <laughs> Don't even start. This was for, uh, 45. 45. So for that and the messy, it'll be 150. Do 110? No. So I don't have the five. No. Or it's PayPal anyway. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was like, I was like, oh, can I have another one for the pay? Oh no, I've got one actually, it's all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we said 110. I just bought that just now. Yeah, I, put, I, I paid 130 for it. Did you? I think it might be a bit high. There was a comp at 120. But it's, it's a long-term hold. I just think eye appeal-wise, like, yeah, that can the, sit in the, the case. The Atomics definitely go for, go for a lot more than, than an average out of 250. Yeah. Oh. So what did we say? I forgot what the... 115. 
Mama five. Not one ten. No. Okay. Still not. No, I do Max Verstappen MGC. I oh, don't you like MGC? Yeah. No, that Shout out MGC. Uh, I'm not not big on F1 at the moment. Neither am I. I don't know why. I although, it's a, these although it's a good deal. I don't know why I accept these things. They look nice together. Look nice with the. Uh, What's the Pedri? What's the Pedri? Uh, that's 120. Oh, 120. I might pass on the Pedri. But I'll definitely get these two. Oh, there, there I was, waiting for him to come with a counter offer. Oh, do you know what I was thinking about it? I was thinking about it. But I'm more just like focused on the numbers stuff. Although I've just bought something that's 250, but like pretty much the same thing. Yeah, it's pretty much the same thing. We can have a Saka. For? 280. They're numbered between. Yeah, the Peacocks are. Between 16 and 18. So they're at 17 now. Oh, right. Okay, I didn't know that. That's yeah, good to know. Yeah, they're really low. Same oh. as the Colour Blasts. Colour Blasts are around 16, 17. Right, okay. But last year's Colour Blasts, I mean, the Mason Mount's already got a pop 19. Right. Plus whatever, whatever was lower graded. Yeah. What's the uh, messy bubbles? Uh, 30. Because according to Soft Cards HQ, the blue bubbles is out of 50. Okay. So this is 115. Yeah. Could you do that for no. 25? Yeah. And then we can round it off. Okay, so you don't get any fibers. Yeah, but I'll pay you by PayPal anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was I'm trying to pick up a messy card. I managed to pick up two, so I'm good with that. I need to grab your PayPal actually, if that's okay. Yeah. Oh, it's easier if I type in. Right? Yeah. You can sign oh, the number. Where I don't even know what was that. So we, we said. 40, was it? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It was well, it was one fifteen, wasn't it? And then we did this for twenty five. Yeah. Quick maths. I think I told him what the answer was before. Was it one forty? Yeah. No, I'm, I'm joking. I'm joking. Too. Most definitely. We need to find a Leeds fan. Yeah. Maybe that might be a bit. That might be a bit difficult. Well, maybe not. 60, 60, like your, like your Yorkshire card show, that's the place to take it, yeah. It's up north, it's up north though, isn't it? Or maybe I could do like a uh, a call out. If you are interested in a SGC 1010 Tyler Adams to 99, let us know. Card sales on Instagram. Card sales on Instagram. Mine at card sales, and I will take 50% of the profits made from. So there we are, that does it for the both videos of the London Car Show. I hope you have enjoyed it. Thank you again to Pack Rip for being in the first video and for helping film the second video. And thank you for everyone that appeared in the video as well. Apologies if I didn't get like a, a tag on your name. Just message me if you did so that I know what your usernames are for the future. That would be helpful. So there we are. If you have enjoyed this video, please do drop a big like on the video. It does really, really help out the channel. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. If you'd like to see some behind the scenes card show content, check out the uh, members page so you can join by using the link in the description down below. Don't forget to use the referral code SportsCardsUK when downloading VOT for the first time. Again, thank you for them for sponsoring both videos. And uh, yeah, I will see you on the next Sports Cars UK video. Thanks very much.